After 9 years in deep space, NASA officially bid farewell to the Kepler telescope. The most prolific planet hunting machine has finally run out of fuel and the American Space Agency has decided to retire the spacecraft within its current safe orbit away from Earth. The spacecraft revealed a universe full of planets. Kepler's catalog of confirmed planets includes over 2600 worlds and dozens that could potentially support alien life. That's 70% of the 3800 confirmed alien worlds to date. But the announcement was not a surprise. The planet hunting machine has been running low on fuel for months. That's why mission managers had to put the spacecraft to sleep several times recently to extend its operational life as much as possible. The spacecraft detected planets by looking for their transits. When a planet passes between its star and Earth, it causes a small dip in the light of the star and this is called the transit method. The most recent analysis of Kepler's discoveries concludes that 20 to 50% of the stars visible in the night sky are likely to have small, possibly rocky planets similar in size to Earth and located within the habitable zone of their parent stars. But you might be wondering what's next? First of all, while the telescope has stopped collecting new data, astronomers are still working with what they have collected over the years. One of Kepler's successors is currently in space and searching for new planets. NASA's TESS spacecraft, short for Transiting Exoplanet Survey Satellite, has already spotted its first pair of Earth-like planets and will continue to do so. NASA prepared TESS to do its job for two years. But engineers are already thinking about how to expand its mission. There's a difference between the two planet hunters though. While Kepler spotted faraway exoplanets at least several hundred light years from Earth, TESS will focus on planets close enough to be investigated in depth by other instruments, especially NASA's James Webb Space Telescope. The Webb Telescope will be able to take a much closer look perhaps even look for signs of life on the worlds that Tess and Kepler have found. NASA's Webb Telescope is set to launch on March 30, 2021.